Hello again team, it's Jess or Jashi Karen, and welcome back for another video. Today we're looking at over 120 bullet journal theme ideas for December. Again, I've tried to not include double ups from the previous theme ideas videos that we've had for October and November, but some of the ones mentioned in those videos would still be fitting for the month ahead. If you hadn't already seen them, the video links can be found in the description box below, but let's have a look at the ideas we have for December. Just like our last theme ideas video, I first went to look for inspiration with December's international and national holidays, periods of awareness, or periods of recognition. This includes international and national days, weeks, and for some, the full month of December. Not all of these are celebrated in all places, but some of them might be celebrated where you are. I have tried to focus only on the ones that I could see being a monthly bullet journal theme, and as there are quite a few that are Christmas related, I've also tried to pull those out so we don't double up with our Christmas specific themes which we'll look at later. But in terms of this category, we have Thai Month, Spiritual Literacy Month, Universal Human Rights Month or Human Rights Day, one of the symbols for which is hands or handprints. It's also good to mention here that while I list these days of recognition, you don't have to do the theme in the way I worded. For instance, the next idea, Hand Washing Awareness Week, you could do a theme that's related to soaps and lotions and skincare. Take the ideas as inspiration and expand on them. Another example, for Drunk and Drugged Driving Prevention Month, you could have little doodles of snowmen driving cars, like this poster here. For Influenza Vaccination Week, you could do little virus doodles or needles. Of course, not all themes on this list are going to be for all people, but we have a lot of December related theme ideas here, so in theory, there's something for everyone. Back to listing, in December we also have World AIDS Day, there's Eat a Red Apple Day, which I think a red apple theme would be pretty cute. We have the Romania National Holiday, Mutt Day, the National Day of the United Arab Emirates, the International Sweater Festival, so it's like festival with a V, Roof Over Your Head Day, so maybe doing a little homely or homemaker theme, Mountain Day, Let's Hug Day, there's Bartender Day and Bartender Appreciation Day, the National Day for Lao, the Day of Persons with Disabilities, Sock Day, not to be confused with Odd Sock Day, which was in November, Farmer's Day, which is celebrated in Ghana, we have Faux Fur Friday, which you could do something like an animal print theme for, World Wildlife Conservation Day, and also the International Animal Rights Day. We have Wear Brown Shoes Day, or Put On Your Own Shoes Day, Skyworn Recognition Day, which I think would be a cute excuse to do a weather theme, Cheetah Day, Chester Greenwood or Earmuff Day, Dice Day, Fat Bike Day, and not to say that my doodle is necessarily of a fat bike, but a bicycle theme would be cute, Bathtub Party Day, Candle Day or Candle Lighting Day, you could do a Planes theme for Civil Aviation Day or Wright Brothers Day, We've got Energy Conservation Day, Ninja Day, and I think my ninja kind of ended up looking more like a ninja turtle. Miner's Day, Letter Writing Day, which honestly I really want to do a letters theme, so that one would work quite well. Device Appreciation Day, Horse Day, Dingaling Day, which is a day that encourages us to reconnect with people that we used to talk with more often. Also in the month of December we have Call a Friend Day. There's App Day, Flashlight Day, Pretend to be a Time Traveler Day, which I think would make for a very cool theme. There's the Flag of India Day, Llama Day, which I've seen people do some pretty cute llama themes, so that would be a fun one for December as well. Crossword Puzzle Day, Look for an Evergreen Day, we have Emo Day, Mathematics Day, Poinsettia Day, which is honestly the flower that I most associate with Christmas. There's Kwanzaa, and in some years you'll also have Hanukkah. We have Card Playing Day, Boxing Day, Violin Day, Roots Day, and by this I mean like family roots, not like actual tree roots. New Year's Eve, Dewey Decimal System Day, which would be a good excuse to do a books theme. We've got Monkey Day, Las Posadas, Wear Your Pearls Day, 
the Day of Reconciliation, Wreaths Across America Day, Arabic Language Day, and apologies if my Arabic doesn't look quite right, this is the first time I've written any Arabic. We've got Bali and Barney Backlash Day, Festivus, Cut Out Snowflakes Day, Thank You Note Day, Short Film Day, and The Solstice, whether that be the Winter Solstice or the Summer Solstice, depending on where you are. Along with these ones, we also have a lot of international and national days that are food or drink related, so I decided to group those ones separately. Again, you don't have to do a bacon day theme, but you could have a bacon theme in general to go along with or to celebrate bacon day. Looking through the ones we have here though, we of course have bacon day. There's also champagne day, pumpkin pie day, which I personally associate more with November, but it's celebrated in December. You could do a popcorn theme for the business of popping corn day. We have eggnog day, lager day, Fruitcake Day, Brownie Day. Why did I decide to group all these together? Because now I'm just getting hungry. <laughs> we have Chocolate Candy Day, Cotton Candy Day, Maple Syrup Day, French Fried Shrimp Day, which I just thought that a prawns theme would be kind of cute. Ice Cream Day. You could do a cookies theme for either Cookie Day, Bake Cookies Day, or Cookie Exchange Day, or Cookie Cutter Week, which are all celebrated in December. We have Sangria Day, Tea Day, and I really want to do a tea theme, especially with little tea bags, I think it'd be really cute. Roast Chestnuts Day, we've got Hard Candy Day, Cupcake Day, Chocolate Covered Anything Day, I've decided to put in a chocolate coated strawberry, Cabernet Franc Day, or Wine and Grapes theme, Roast Suckling Pig Day, and also Christmas Pudding. Christmas Pudding Day, or Stir Up Day as it's called, is technically in November, but I think it's a more suitable theme for December. This leads us into our next theme category, and you knew it was coming. These are our Christmas related theme ideas. Of course, just like we talked about in October for Halloween, you can just have a Christmas in general theme. So nothing too specific, just Christmas related doodles. What can be fun though is to be a little bit more specific, so doing things like a candy cane theme or a presents theme. Some other ideas include elves, reindeer, you could do a stockings theme or a Christmas Eve or night before Christmas theme, a theme related to Christmas carols or Christmas carolers, a Christmas sweaters theme would be super fun, in particular if you made it kind of like an ugly Christmas sweaters theme, Christmas cards. Christmas trees, you could have a theme dedicated to Mrs. Claus, or of course, Santa Claus himself, a Christmas decorations theme, a Christmas gift tags theme, Christmas cookies, you know, to go with all the other cookie related days there are in December, a gingerbread houses or gingerbread men theme, a Christmas lights theme, which I did last December, you could do a theme around Christmas movies or just one Christmas movie in particular. So that could be something like Elf, or Die Hard, or Miracle on 34th Street, or if you consider it a Christmas film, Nightmare Before Christmas. You could have an Operation Santa Paws theme, so like animals with Christmas hats, that kind of thing. You could have a white Christmas theme, a theme that's based on traditional Christmas stories, or maybe a theme based on Santa's naughty and nice list. Obviously this isn't an exhaustive list of Christmas related themes, but it's a good starting point. Following those theme ideas though, we also have our miscellaneous category, so for themes that would work well for December which don't fit into our other categories. For this you can of course do a seasonal theme, so whether that be a summer related theme if you're in the southern hemisphere like I am, or a winter related theme if you're in the north. You could have a theme based on the December birth flower which although it isn't a flower, holly is listed, and that is very suitable for December. You could do a theme based on one of the birthstones for December, so tanzanite, zircon, or turquoise. And then you could also do themes related to Sagittarius, so whether that be Sagittarius itself, or a bows and arrows or archery theme. So as I said at the start, plenty of themes to choose from for December, but of course you don't have to do one of these ones. 
Question of the day for you though, of the themes we have here, which one or ones would you be the most likely to try? For me, like I said, I really want to do a tea theme and a letters theme. I actually think that a crossword puzzle theme would be pretty cool too. But I'd love to know which one or ones you guys would be keen to try. Now as my hand is sufficiently sore though from drawing out all of these different ideas, here I'll say, as always, thank you for watching. If you liked today's video, please do make sure to give it a big thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to my channel for more on planning, productivity, and personal development. Until next time, bye.